A recall that organized labor had called off the strike for a week after the federal government pleaded for negotiations on a new national minimum wage. Union representatives say the strike, which affected several sectors of the, the country's economy, was triggered after weeks of failed negotiations. Well, it seems that the unions are preparing for a resumption of the strike action. Public affairs analyst Akin Fatake joins me on the news to discuss this further. Thank you for your time, sir. Now, Labour has outrightly rejected all offers below its demand of 250,000 Naira and has even threatened to resume its strike on Tuesday if the government fails to meet its demand. Is this a logical move considering the economic challenges in the country? Steve Salad, good evening and uh, thanks for having me. I would like to say clear cuts, understandably, understandably, and I will take it from a different perspective before we go into the economics, so the economics is there. We are being assailed from left, right, and center by insensate and insensitive elites and governments. Justice is not making sense. I cannot be having a wound on my leg and you can help me with a little bit of a bandage. It doesn't help the cure. But not at the same time, you are supposed to give me a tetanus injection. You refuse to give me that tetanus injection, and then you still bind me to the Philistines. We are not showing good example. Yes, the economic reality is that things are very, very expensive. Things are very, very hard. No doubt about it, you know? But that is perhaps where it may have to stop. We now need to put um, a thin line, and there appear to be a thin line in here. Nigerian Labour Congress and the TUC are, are speaking for workers, workers all over. I think it's now been properly expanded, not just federal workers, even at the states. Now, if the states are saying they are incapable of, of paying, Again, one may understand, but one will not understand the kind of hostetation that we begin to see, even while the, we, are, we are still trying to cook this. Well, nice head governors buying SUVs for their legislators, a lot of shenanigans going up, up and down. It is, it's, it's vestigious. So let's get back to the economics. My prescription has always been the fact that we are not supposed to be talking about living wage. Look, there is a difference. The minimum wage is the least you are supposed to be paying people who are working. People who are working, not necessarily people who are not working. People who are working, and that is the first level entry. If you do the maths, in reality, it comes to big numbers. And economics is certainly opportunity costs and uh, forgone alternatives. I want to see situations where all tiers of government stream down cost of governance, especially when it comes to um, headcount labor, labor costs. Having said that, I expect that some of the things that labor should also be looking at will be things that are not necessarily monetary. Can we, and I know we have been trying to push that for quite a while, can we now begin to now look for much more enduring things, transportation subsidy, can we be looking for education subsidy, can we be looking for health subsidy, that is going to be much more encompassing and takes care of the whole lot. As I speak, I mentioned it to you, Simisola, and I was very clear. I can understand the pain and the angst of a people being deprived of the nebulous 250, and then you are taking four or five times. Very few people. I mean, it just does not make sense. But, you know, put all put together, companies are flying with their feet. Part of it is the unstable environment where you are going to be asking them to add that kind of quantum into their payroll. They cannot afford it. And the only other way will be to be job, job cuts and job losses. I think the labor has a right to go on strike. I think the labor should, if they saw the man go on strike, 
But I think the labor has to draw a line. Uh, some of the things that happened the last time should not repeat itself. It's a plea. It's a plea. It's a plea that I'm also making here. Yeah? 